My name's Sarah Giles. I am the Gardens and Countryside Manager here at The Vine. Nature is a massive part of the National Trust. We have an initiative to try and get people out to reconnect with nature so they understand the importance of it and they can help us care for it in the future as well. And it also helps with things like mental health problems, it helps with biodiversity, it helps with exercise, it helps with so many things. Just coming here and enjoying these beautiful spaces, getting away from their day-to-day nine-to-five life makes a real impact on people's mental health in a positive way. I'm Natalie and I'm director of a Reading-based organisation called Nature Nurture. Our mission is to connect local people with the wild spaces on their doorstep. We think that um, being outside is really important when you're a child. It's the possibilities from puddles and splashing the puddles to climbing a tree to collecting conkers, discovering bugs, all these things really we find they can have an amazing calming effect on the children. Being outside gives children a lot more opportunities to move around and to, to work together as teams. Put a few kids together and suggest they might build a den. It really supports um, interpersonal skills and all that sort of teamwork that's really vital to us becoming social beings as adults. My name is Amanda Ringham. I work for the Hampshire Land of White Wildlife Trust as a conservation projects manager. We have about 700 regular volunteers. They come out, they help us to get our work done, they help us to protect nature, and in return they're getting that exposure to the natural world, but they're also meeting new people, making new friends, they've got shared interests. In the UK, illnesses and issues such as obesity, mental illness, cardiac disease cost the UK economy about £180 billion annually and yet study after study has shown that exposure to nature, being in the outdoors, can help to reduce or improve many of these conditions. Cultural services are all the non-material benefits that people get from contact with nature. So that might be going for a run, recreation like a picnic, or just being able to sit out in a natural, peaceful place and relax. There's a lot of people who get enjoyment from going angling. You've got some trout fishing and then the lower end of the catchment's more coarse fishing. There's match fishing and also specimen hunters looking for big barb and things like that. I love nature and I love being outside. Being in nature, being in the countryside, where there's the variety of colours, the variety of nature itself. My spirit soars.